We're gonna do a little review for him. What up, guys? Bourbon Bandits, I'm Tyler. Hey, I'm Zach. Hey, Dancy. Biggest day of the day. He's, uh, gonna, he's gonna join us for a while. Yeah. He's yeah. gonna keep joining us until we kick his ass. <laughs> I got uh, a review of Rebel Cast Ring is what we're gonna do this evening. Yeah, man, we got. Oh, my little pop well. Yeah, all right, <laughs> Jesus Christ, let's get this fucking accident over with. Cheers, cheers, cheers. To the Cheers, 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 cheers to you guys. Thanks for joining us. Chicken Proper 12 is uh, gonna keep your spirits in high spirits. Alright guys, we got Rebel Cast Drink. This is a single barrel that we got from one of our local stores, Forks Farmington, right here. Thank you guys, you guys always have some good products coming through. And what are we looking at, man? It's got some proof to it. We are looking at 120 proof today, guys. 120, a little bit of, a little bit of a heater. But, people like it, there's a following with it. Let's see what it's about. And it's, you can find it. You can find it anywhere, guys. You can find it. What? 50 bucks, 60 bucks, I think we got it 45 50, bucks. Yeah, 55. Yeah. Cheers, guys, thanks for tuning in. Ooh. That's got like a little little raspberry, oh, strawberry flavor to it. It's got some proof, that's for sure. Just punching the nose of these things. You things. slowly smell, you don't snort. Yeah, I did not <laughs> snort. Put jam in your big nose. Put man. jam in your nose pecker in there. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Stuff, stuff goes in this thing quick. Uh, there's a citrus behind it, that's for sure. Citrus. Yeah, maybe, maybe citrus, citrus. citrus don't look for I said raspberry first. Yeah, I, I, give more citrus. I can give raspberries acidity to it. It's got some kind of fruit like that to it. God damn. <laughs> I, just to, I just want to be able to smell it. I don't think anything too crazy on the nose. I mean, maybe it's just bourbon, heat, citrus. I mean, yeah. yeah maybe, <laughs> that's what I'm getting off the maybe nose. a little bit of chocolate. There's a little bit of. A little bit of char. It smells really nice. Can you, can you smell char? I guess you can smell char. Firewood, you can smell fire, right? Yeah. I get it from that. Yeah, of course you can smell char. Well, you know, sometimes I think about what I say after I say what I thought about. Like what you just said? <laughs> <laughs> it becomes a problem. Alright, let's see what it's about. I'm not having to waft it as much as I can get it up all the way in there. Ooh, I like that on the back. It is very oaky, smoky, kind of almost toasted, like almost. That actually finishes very well. Yeah, I like that a lot. It coats really well, got the hug going on. It reminds me of the smoke wagons. It kind of does, but it's got right. that like more tobacco-y, fruity right. kick to it than it does with a smoke wagon. A little bit of a citrus still, definitely some smoke on that bad boy. I can, I compare it to the smoke wagon uh, uncut and filter. Yeah, yeah. no, it's a little I mean, bit more fruity on it. That's high up there, which is yeah, that's really good. Nifty. Well, so we we I think we ended up drinking what you see in the first night we had this guy, and it was just when we opened it, it was just a bunch of heat for the most part. Yeah. You got to practice. What yeah. they say is you got to hit the bottle down, get, to, get it to the neck, and let you know, it sit, and you know you're not gonna pour it out. So why not drink with your friends? Definitely the the smoky, but I'm getting the like smokies. a little, I'm getting a little bit of like leathery notes on the back end too. I agree with that. I, I get that one the smoke. I, I can really smell it too on much. Fire. Leather, anything like that nature. Definitely, you know, that lovely oakness. But it's almost like a, like a spice too. Right? Not necessarily like, you know, like it's like, maybe it's a high rye content or a high rye mash bill or something. I do not know. I could be wrong. I have no idea. Maybe just because how hot it is, proof wise, that's what making it kind of give like that spice heat flavor to it. Yeah, I do not know. No, it's got a mash bill. I, I, I enjoy this. This is nice. Yeah. Yeah. It's almost got, I, I agree, like the spice, there's like a slight. Peppery note to it. It's got, yes. like, it's got like that little spice note on it as well. It is nice. It's super complex. I mean, I, I do enjoy it, especially for 55 bucks. Don't that, store pick. Yeah, don't mix it with anything. No. You lost your mind. We generally try to buy stuff that we wouldn't mix, so. But we do have stuff back there that I will mix. The shit. Yeah. All right, we got a score on this guy. I have a score on this guy as well. I'm going to bash it. Not really bash it, but it's good. It's not great, but it's good. Tyler's over here ranking nanos and shit. Bro, I really like that bottle. It's a fucking great bottle. Heard it first. Eight o. It was good. It was good. It was you, good. You're good. I'm giving it an eight o. It was good. That's weird. I was gonna give it an eight o as well. So, what do you got? Downtown Spencer's Land. What do you have over there? So, I wanted to rate better. I think it's better than the single barrel. Well, then rate it the way you want, bro. Rate it the way you want. So we're gonna do eight point four. 
8.4. 0 0.1 better than the other one. Yes. <laughs> oh, no, wait, no, but then that way that should match up. It's right. actually an 8. Point, it's the exact same thing. Uh, 8.1. 8.1? 8.1. He's enough. That's fine. Oh. 8.1 for Rebel Cash Drink. Find it anywhere. Give you five bucks a bottle. We got it from Corks Farmington because we're G's. Yeah, thank you guys. We G appreciate G's. all this. Your local liquor store should have it. Get it, buy it, try if it. not, you to get it. And I, I mean, uh, one of our other local stores just came out with their own uh, store pig as well. So it's yeah, everywhere, people guys. Got to get it. it. Yeah. An 8.1 8 across three people? I mean, that's a good model. Yeah, right? yeah, that's not bad at all. Peace out, eight towns down. We'll see you next time around, which is next time you watch this video. We're going to see you at that point in time. We'll tell you something new that you didn't know, but you're not going to know what we're going to tell you until then. We'll see you then. Every time. Saturday. Every time. Yeah. I'm Zach. Tyler. Tyler. It's bigger than the sea. And we'll see you on Thursday. Peace.